We're back. I don't know. If We're back. <laughs> We're back with a new vlog today, you guys. It's just me and Kalel home right now. And we just got in. That's why I have all my coat and stuff, so I'm going to have to take my coat off. But, um, yeah. Got homework to do. We've got more cleaning to do. Eating. Yeah, I guess you can have a snack, an afternoon lunch or whatever. You can have that. And um, Jalen will be home later. Smash will be home real late today. So um, it's just going to be us for a I'm little while. Back to ASP tomorrow. Yeah, I'm going back to ASP. Uh, I'll tell you guys later. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're home for the day. School is over. Work is over. And we're so glad to be home. I've been having to pick up Kalel from school the past three days. And I'm getting spoiled to this coming Greetings. home early. Friday. Well, Friday, yesterday, and today. Oh. Yeah, three days. So, yeah, I'm getting spoiled to coming home early. I've been leaving work like 1.30, 2 o'clock. So, I've been getting spoiled. My regular off time is 4 o'clock. So, even though it's just a couple of hours, it's still really nice to get home early. So, I've been enjoying that. But tomorrow, I have to go back. Well, goes back to after school, and I go back to working all day long. Mm. Poor Good mom. for you, bad for me. <laughs> but yeah, so I um, got that squared away. What else is going on? I really need to get my coupons together today. I need to go shopping. We have nothing in this house. Nothing. nothing. All we got is crackers. <laughs> we don't even have any more and crackers. Raisins. Oh yeah, Too we have a ton raisins. of raisins and cranberries, but we don't have we don't even have any crackers left. I think maybe four. Crackers. No, those mini crackers. Remember? Oh, we never ate nobody them. eats those. But um, we don't have anything in here. I just bought some milk, bread, and cheese just now, just to kind of hold us down until I can get to the supermarket. But um, I ain't put all my coupons together. Let me show you this, guys. It's a little bit of a mess over here, but just look anyway. So I cut out. All my coupons from the week before last. And these, this is the, like, I know I shouldn't have this here, but I just kind of threw them down. But anyway, these are two piles of coupons that I need to file in my binder. And then I have, from last week, eight inserts that I have to cut out still. Frappy, give me my scarf. That I still have to cut out. I don't even see that. And um, I think I'm going to work on that today. But first, I'm going to go downstairs and finish taking the lights off the tree so um, everything could be off the tree. And we can get rid of that tree. And I still have to kind of pack up that stuff, so I might do that too. Like finish packing up the stuff and putting it in the garage. My living room is almost clean, you guys. We're almost there. <laughs> almost. I have some more laundry, though. So, yeah. Let me put the light on. Thank you. So, and that light isn't really all that good. But anyway, so yeah, we're just going to um, kind of wind down from being at work and school all day. Turn that one out. Okay. And, yeah, that's better. <sighs> yeah, so I guess Kalel's going to get a late lunch snack, an afternoon lunch snack. And I'm going to have some tea. I'm going to start putting this Christmas stuff away. And I'm going to head upstairs to... Um, Coupon and stuff like that. So, what's he doing? Yeah, right. That's not what you were doing a minute ago. <laughs> so, yeah, I have all this stuff to put away, you guys. All this stuff in these two bins. There's the tree there, so it has the lights on. There's like stuff over there that all has to be put away. So, I'm gonna try to get to that today. It shouldn't really take me that long. I just want to make sure that it's packed really well because I don't want stuff breaking. You know what I mean? Like, you put it in the box, and then you're shifting boxes throughout the whole year in the garage and everything, and then stuff breaks when you, when you know, when you're doing that. So I try to put like bubble wrap and like wrap up things, like especially these things. And this is all my breakable stuff, the wooden men and all that, you know. So I have to rewrap all that stuff in the bubble wrap. Hey, don't do that. Don't do that like that. You have to start where the plug is. You can't just start anywhere. Um, so yeah, I like to wrap all of that stuff up so that it doesn't break throughout the, you know, the whole year. And, um, 
you know, it's put away, it's put away good. So that's what I have to do. Like I took all the ornaments off, but they're just in the box. So I have to like kind of dump those out, put the bubble wrap, and then put them back in the box, you know, covered with the bubble wrap. So in case that box gets thrown around, it won't damage anything. So yep, yeah, that's about it. And then I just have to vacuum down here, which I probably let one of the kids do. And that's it. I have like two big boxes that I have to send off that had Christmas stuff in them. Um, so pretty much that'll hopefully be done by the weekend and I can get that stuff out Monday because I know I'm not going to get it out this week. I still have things I need to make and all that stuff. So I'm going to try to take care of that over the weekend and get these boxes mailed out. Christmas is way over, but hey, it's always nice to get gifts, right? So I'm sure they'll appreciate getting the gifts even though they're late. Does anyone know where I can... Um, like get rid of like old keyboards and stuff like that. I can sell them or just get rid of them. I hate to just throw them in the trash, but I have a bunch of keyboards that I need to get rid of and like old calculators that I really need to get rid of. And they're just sitting here in my foyer, and I really want to get rid of them. I think Smash may know, but he didn't say anything, so that leads me to believe that maybe he doesn't know. But anyway. Yeah, now this is a braid out I did on my hair, you guys, and I just kind of twisted up the sides or whatever, and then just got a clip in the back. I don't know if you like, that was totally random. <laughs> but anyway, let me go, guys. We'll be back later, I guess, when Jay gets home, and we'll let him say hello, because y'all haven't really heard from the Smash family since last year. It's a new year, y'all. So, I got to let everybody come on the vlog and say hello. Smash is going to be, he's going to have an attitude later, but hey, he I'm put him on the vlog too. But he's going to be tired because he's getting off really late tonight. But I'll try to uh, let him peep in and say hello to you guys. And that is about it. Um, let me go get and drink my tea and warm up. And I need to do laundry. I need to do a load of laundry. So, I may just do that real quick. Yeah, I need to put that on real quick. But do that, finish this Christmas stuff, and go do my coupons. See y'all later. Hey, y'all. So, I'm back. And we finished. Finally. Finished putting all the Christmas stuff away. Turn the light. I finished putting all the Christmas um, stuff away. The tree is now bare. And, yeah. That's stuff that has to be shipped out. And the green thing will go back. Like once I label everything, because like the wrapping paper and stuff is in there. So that'll go back when I'm done with those two boxes. And yeah, I decided to go ahead and fold up the clothes. So that's done. So everybody just needs to come get their stuff now. I'm not putting everybody's stuff away. They come put their own stuff away. So I'm going to do that. I did that. So I almost have my living room back. I'm sorry, I'm picking up these things from folding up the laundry. They fly all over the place. Um, so I almost got my living room back, y'all. Super excited. Can't wait to see when it's really, really just clean, you know? Because usually it's not dirty, usually, because we're never really in the living room. But because we pulled all of that stuff out and we did laundry and stuff, it was a wreck. So now it's all good. Let me get out of that light. It's all good. And the house looks bare. Because all the Christmas decorations are gone. I hate when Christmas is over. Because you know all the decorations make the house look so nice. Like, look at my mantle. <laughs> Bare. Y'all saw what it looked like during the holidays. Um, and I still have to change those candles out. I'm going to change those red candles out. But, yeah. House is clean, everything. All Christmas stuff is put away anyway. Now, the regular stuff needs to just be put away. And I'm not up for that today. I'm tired now. I don't want myself out <laughs> picking up them bins and putting them away in the garage. So, like, it's completely done. I don't have to, like, like, I didn't put anything to the side or anything like that and do it for later. No. I put everything, packed everything up, bubble wrapped. All the stuff needed to be bubble wrapped and, you know, all the lights needed to be. I'm very anal when it comes to putting away Christmas decorations. I don't know about y'all, but... It's just because when it's time to take out the decorations the next time, I don't want to be fighting with lights and fighting with garland and all of this stuff. So 
I get real anal when it's time to put um, the Christmas decorations away. I want them done a certain way. This way, when it's time to take them out, it's so much easier. We could just put the decorations up with no problems, you know, and go about decorating rather than spending an hour and two hours trying to untangle stuff. I hate that. I really feel just like, oh, I hate that. So, yeah, I have to put the decorations away a certain a certain way because I don't like all of that fighting and stuff when it's time to pull them out again. So, everything has been put away just the way I want it. And I packed the stuff up and put it in the garage. So, the garage is packed. And that stuff won't be coming out until next Christmas. So, that's done, finally. Now, I just have to, you know, just regular clean up now. <laughs> But, you know, that'll be done throughout the week and on the weekend, of course. My kitchen is not messy at all. Oh, my gosh. It's amazing. My kids um, are pitching in lately. And been, their chore is to do the dishes. And so they have to do the dishes, clear off the counter, like wipe down the counter, wipe down the stove, and wipe off the table, the kitchen table. And, um... Like, put whatever dirty dishes that we have, put those in the dishwasher. So, yeah, they did that last night, and I told them if they stick with the plan, the next day it should not be a mess. And it's not. They did all this yesterday. So, we just have, like, a couple little things that need to be put away, but for the most part, everything is clean. So, that's great. So, I'm about to have me a cup of soup. I made some homemade soup the other day. And I'm about to eat that because I'm hungry. Hey, you need to make up your bed. Take everything off your bed. Make it up correctly. Okay? Hang up your coat. Put your stuff that belongs in your book bag in your book bag. I see your agenda on the floor and all of that. Put it away. Clean up your area and take your clothes out for tomorrow, please. Okay? Go. So, yeah. Sorry. So, um, you're about to eat this soup. It's, um white bean and ham soup. This recipe is actually on my Lady Smash channel. So if you're interested in making it, it's super easy. If you have a crock pot, you don't even need a crock pot. You can do it on the stove, but I do mine in the crock pot. On limited ingredients, very simple, but very hearty and tasty. So if you like like white beans, like this is, I use the Great Northern Bean in this soup. Delish. Delish. So, yeah, I didn't eat all of my dinner last night. We had soup and sandwiches last night. For some reason, my appetite is changing, which is a good thing. Because <laughs> I've been eating everything and anything, you guys. I gained, like, 20 pounds from the time that my mother left. Well, the time my mother got here till now. It's been 20 pounds that I have gained or over the holidays or whatever you want to say. 20 pounds. So, I have to... Get back on it, y'all. The struggle is real. Y'all already know. If y'all been on weight loss journeys or if you on weight loss journeys, the struggle is real trying to keep that weight off. Look how fast I just put on that 20 pounds. And I, like, summertime, I was good. I was perfect. I was right where I wanted to be in the summertime. And then I just let it go. Let it go. Let it go. I guess that's what I did because... 20 pounds are here now, and it's all over me, and my face, and my, everywhere. <laughs> so, it's time to get back on the bandwagon. I'm not totally motivated, like 100% motivated just yet. So, I had started P90X3 last week, but like I said, I'm not 100% mentally ready to be working out. And so, I think I did like the first three days, and then I stopped. <laughs> So, I really need to um, get back on it. So, I plan to do that really soon. It might just be next month. I don't know. But I plan on doing something until I start P90X. I have these little challenges, um, like 30-day challenges, and they're all different ones. I think it's the there's a website for it. It's called 30-day 30 30 fitnesschallenges.com or 30daychallenges.com or Y'all Google that and see. But anyway, it's a website that has all these different challenges that you can do for 30 days. And um, I think I'm just going to do one of those. I think I'm going to do probably like the little black dress, the little black dress challenge. And because um, I need to do something. I just, I just feel like I need to do something. You know what I mean? So, yeah, we've already like cut out some of the foods that we're not supposed to be eating. 
So that's a start, but yeah, we need to move this along a little bit faster. So, um, yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm going to do something. But uh, let me go now. Since I'm done down here, I'm going to go back upstairs now with my soup and my water. And probably watch another episode or two of Sons while I clip my coupons. Hey guys, so I had an unsuccessful... What? I felt okay. I finished cleaning. I came upstairs to finish watching Sons, right? And, you know, we stream everything, so everything is internet-based here. So I come upstairs to watch Sons. We ain't got no internet. Yeah. So we got to pay the bill. That's what happened to me. So... <laughs> I was gonna get, I was I woke up and I was trying to watch some TV, but I went and watching my show cut me off. So I can watch. Oh, it cut off in the middle of the show. Yeah, and I was talking to my friend. Damn. So it cut me off. So yeah. So anyway, I try to go to pay the bill, right? And um, I'm on hold for 15 minutes with these people, just for them to get on the line and tell me, oh, can you call back in 25 minutes because our system is down. Why they couldn't put an automated message on the system or something like that saying on the phones saying, our system is down, please call back, instead of having people wait in 15 minutes to talk to somebody. That's ridiculous. I hate my internet people. They just, mm -hmm. ugh. They charge too much, and they don't be working sometimes. It just, it's ridiculous. How come you don't get grandma's internet? Because we don't live in her area. There's internet for certain areas. So anyway, now that that's happened, I can't put together my coupons because I got to be on the internet to the site that I want to use to put do my matchups. Um, I'll probably still clip my other ones. I'm, you know, I'm getting ready to watch a movie with Jalen. We're getting ready to watch Lord of the Rings, my favorite movie of all time. We're watching Return of the King. This is my favorite um, part of the Lord of the Rings is the Return of the King, which is the third disc in the trilogy. So we getting ready to watch that. Because we don't have nothing else to do. We ain't got no internet. I'm just, ugh. Can't watch my sons. Can't do nothing. What's up with that? That's just the future. So anyway, we about to watch this movie. I think Big Smash is going to wind up coming home early. I just got off the phone with him and he said he is done <laughs> at that job today. So um, I'm going to save the um, overtime for another day. So anyway, we can make it into this movie. We will see y'all back when um, Smash gets home. But anyway, Jalen wanted to say hi. He's in from school. Uh, I know they want to know what that circle thing is. You just uh, held up. Uh, <laughs> it's a rice cake. What? Boys got to eat. Yeah. I'm surprised you didn't put nothing on it. But anyway, um, yeah, we wanted to let Jalen say hi and Happy New Year. Because y'all ain't seen him since last year. And Merry Christmas if I didn't say it already. Yeah, we ain't been on none of the holiday. We just went MIA. <laughs> <laughs> but we back, y'all. So, anyway, let's watch this movie because, you know, the movie's like three hours. And what time is it anyway? It's like, uh, dang it. What, what's that clock say? 6.17, but I think your clock is early. So that means it's 6 o'clock. And I don't think we're going to watch this whole thing, but we're going to watch something. What comes on today? Does something come on TV today? I don't know if something comes on regular TV today. But, um... We're going to go ahead and watch this. So, we'll see y'all later. Hey, y'all. So, as you can see, I'm about ready for bed. I'm just having a little sandwich here for dinner. Um, Smash is home. You want to say hi and Happy New Year to everybody? Hey, Happy New Year. Hey, you can't see me. I'm doing better than later. He don't want to get on camera, y'all. I told y'all he probably wouldn't. So, anyway, we're going to end the vlog here. Like I said before in the beginning, Happy New Year. We're just coming back to say hey and, you know, we're back and expect more videos from us and stuff. So, yeah, we'll see you in the next vlog, okay? All right, y'all have a good night. Thanks for watching. Bye.